and the call came out for a possible stroke um, at the school, an address that we knew, they told us what school it was, and, and I knew he was a school resource officer there at that time. So I, I told my partner, I said, this has to be Scott. EMS arrives and the fire department got there and um, they started you know, working on me and got into the ambulance. The medics were assessing me, doing all their, their job, asking me a million questions, asking my name a million times. And you know, I knew the medic, but it was making me mad and frustrated. Like, you know my name, quit asking what it is. Well, it's critical that uh, he was able to identify and the people around him were able to identify his symptoms because as a result, he got in here to the emergency room rapidly and we were able to uh, provide him with therapies that uh, otherwise he would not have received. Ambulance personnel can call ahead and relate to the hospital personnel an examination they've performed. They can alert the hospital that a possible stroke patient is en route and that gets the process started at the hospital so that when you arrive they are ready for you. This is our clot box. Everything we need to treat your acute ischemic stroke is in this box. We need to have a CAT scan of your head and we bring you back and if that CAT scan indicates that you are not having a hemorrhage but indeed are having an acute ischemic stroke, we will open this box and everything we need to treat you is in this box.